Hi everyone. Now I am going to explain you about the methods involved in asexual reproduction in different organisms such as unicellular and multicellular organisms. In unicellular organisms, example bacteria, amoeba, leishmania, etc. The fission or breaking is a common method of asexual mode of reproduction. As you know the meaning of fission means breaking or dividing, fusion means joining. So fission are of two types, binary fission and multiple fission. As you know the differences between the asexual and sexual mode of reproduction, the asexual mode of reproduction the single parent is involved in the process of reproduction whereas in the sexual mode of reproduction both male and female parent is involved. So here binary fission the parent is divides into two daughter cells bi means two fission means breaking. So the parent divides into two daughter cells called as binary fission and the single parent divides into many daughter cells called as multiple fission as you know multiple means many. Here in the case of amoeba which perform asexual mode of reproduction by binary fission the single parent of amoeba it divides into two and two daughter cells are formed. Now I will explain you the process step by step. From the given figure you are able to get clear idea about each steps involved in the process of binary fission. First the parent amoeba matures which consisting of nucleus, cytoplasm and other cell organelles undergoes the process called binary fission and now the nucleus started elongated which leads to splitting or division of nucleus. Carry on means nucleus, kinesis means division. So the splitting or the division of nucleus is termed as karyokinesis. Karyokinesis is followed by cytokinesis by constriction of cytoplasm. So the cytoplasm gets constricted and then it leads to division of cytoplasm. Cyto means cytoplasm, kinesis means division. So the cytoplasmic division, the process is called as cytokinesis. Finally, two daughter cells are formed. What we are calling it as a two daughter amoeba. In amoeba, binary fission takes place at any plane, whereas in leishmania, which causes the disease called as kala azar in human being, commonly called as sleeping sickness. This leishmania possesses a whip-like structure termed as flagellum at one end of the cell. Binary fission occurs in a definite orientation or definite plane in relation to these structures. Next coming to the second type of fission called as multiple fission. The other unicellular organisms such as the malarial parasite called plasmodium which causes malaria in human beings. The parent nucleus divides repeatedly which is followed by the repeated cytoplasmic division which forms many number of daughter cells and all these daughter cells are well protected by the outer covering called cyst. When the favorable condition reached, the cyst wall breaks out and it releases the daughter cells. Each daughter cells develops as an young one. In this video, I have explained you about the types of fission binary fission in amoeba, binary fission in leishmania and the multiple fission in plasmodium. Thank you for watching.